Hello everyone, so in this quick video I will show you how you can use Llama 3 on Workers AI together with NA10. If you don't know what Workers AI is, it's basically a Cloudflare service where you can run uh, language models. There are many in the catalog, but today we will focus only on Llama 3. And uh, we will then use it in NA10, for example, with a simple chain or, uh, or with agent. So basically we are going to add here the new worker. And for this purpose, I'm going to use um, this repository from Jack Kalpan, which is really great. And this one will convert uh, calls to worker AI to the um, syntax, basically, uh, of OpenAI. So we will use OpenAI uh, node in NA10 to make calls to our worker. So uh, let's get started with this. So the very first thing that I actually need to do here is to copy the URL of the repository. So I'm going to click here, um, this code button, and I'm going to copy the uh, link URL uh, to the repository. So basically the next thing that you need to do is go to your terminal and I'm currently in my Cloudflare directory that I created before. And I'm going to right now copy, actually clone the repository. So I'm going to enter command git clone and I'm going to paste the URL that I've copied just before. After a few seconds, I should have the all packages uh, on my computer. So I'm going to clear right now the terminal. And as you can see in this directory, I have right now this open AI to cloud for AI directory. I'm going to copy this uh, name and I'm going to change the directory to this one. Now I can install the packages. So I'm going to enter the command npm install. And after a few seconds, I should have all of them um, downloaded. And uh, as you can see, we have here some issues. So I'm going to enter npm audit fix. And uh, after a few seconds, I should have also this done. All right, there is also one more issue to, uh, to solve. So I'm going to enter npm audit fix force. And there we go, we have all done. All right, so uh, the next thing actually to do is to deploy this uh, this worker. So I'm going to enter command npm run deploy. All right, and when I enter this command, I actually uh, should have opened the Cloudflare window. All right, and in this Cloudflare window, I need to actually uh, authorize my um, my uh, application here. So uh, I've granted authorization to Wrangler, which is responsible for deploying the application. And when it's done, I can basically close this window. All right, and with this done, we can go to the Cloudflare dashboard and under tab workers and overview, we can see that we have the new worker here, which is AI Llama Forwarder. So when I'm going to click this one and go to the settings tab, there is the sub tab called triggers. And here we have the R road to to the worker. So I'm going to copy this one and go to the uh, NA10 where I created like the very basic workflow with the chain uh, and I have connected the OpenAI node. So um, basically I added here my credentials for OpenAI and there is the model GPT 3.5 Turbo but it completely doesn't matter in this case because we are going to add the new base URL and we are going to replace the API OpenAI uh, URL with um, the URL of our worker. So uh, with this done, uh, we can go back to the Cloudflare and I'm going to turn on the log streaming. So right now when I'm going to open the chat window and say, hello, uh, I should uh, see the logs in my uh, like Cloudflare dashboard, right? And there is also the response from, uh, from the chat. So basically right now we are using completely uh, Llama free owned Cloudflare worker AI. Uh, what's worth mentioning, it works a bit better with chains than agents. Uh, with agents, I have a bit of bugs, um, but still it's very usable. And I hope you're going to have fun playing with it. So uh, that's all for today. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and to my newsletter. Link like always in the description and see you soon. Bye.